Yes, who's next? Ugh, you again. Are you on time this time? Or are you late? You don't recognize me. You're trying to be funny or something. I've just changed my hairstyle. I'm the same person. What are you, racist? Could you wait? I, I don't know what you're put. Could you take a seat, please? Okay. Uh, can I help you, sir? Okay. Yeah, what is your name? <laughs> Look, please don't fast with me. Don't start with me. I don't know your name individually. I just remember your attitude problem from last time. It looks like it started again. Could I have your name, please, sir? Set timer for four minutes thirty seconds. Okay, four minutes thirty seconds. Starting. I'm telling you, one second. <laughs> I don't know. That. that um noise actually means that there's a biohazard. Yeah, and it means that. It's a certain distance. I'm not. I'm not good at maths and geography, but it's a certain distance away. So, basically, it doesn't matter where you go. You're dead <laughs> because you can't travel further out of it. So we have one each. Fortunately for you, sir, you haven't got one, have you? So we got like three minutes fifty. In case you want to call a loved one. Say goodbye. No, why would I give it to you? You've got kids and grandkids and great grandkids. Don't embarrass yourself. Look how old you are then. So you want me to die and I've never even had children and you've lived your life. How selfish. Oh, because I'm a nurse, I should die for you. What do you think this is? I'm a nurse, not a soldier. Get over it. If you, if you, yeah, look, I don't want to get violent on you, so I know it's not allowed, but I've got enough weapons in there, so you want to die from the gas or, you know, knife wounds, yeah, you're wasting precious time, you got, what's it called, how long you got, two minutes, 55, I know I should be nicer because you're dying, but Nobody's gonna know because you'll be dead, so you're gonna tell really. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't like how you fasted me last time. Do you remember what you said to me? You tried to imply that I, like, told you to be naked while I checked your heartbeat the last time. I told you you're not my type. Anyway, this is like a 
more than I want it to happen to you, but karma, isn't it? Because, you know, when you trouble people, then... <laughs> I'm so sorry <laughs> if you touch me. Well, no, they gave us one each. And to be honest, my one's not even going to fit you because it chokes me to death. But that other doctor next door, he's a cunt. Maybe you can kill him and take his one, I don't know. But they're still, they're going to know that it's not you, isn't it? Him. They're going to know it's not him because you and a doctor. So they're going to, when they, when they see him dead and see you with it on, I ain't going to get away with it. It's not my problem. Okay, run now, because I said, like I said, unless you know where there's a fallout shelter nearby that will let you in, which I doubt, because you'd probably be five minutes late for it anyway. Oh my gosh, one more 28. I'm not joking. No, I'm being 100% serious, yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry that you didn't take me seriously. So you thought, me as a nurse, I'm just going to put on all these capers for no reason. Of course I'm being serious. You want me to tell your wife that you left there? Did you? Did you really? How did you get chlamydia last month then? From her, was it? Yeah. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I can't do it because I'm going to be traumatized I'm from, you know, what's going on. Probably all the records going to destroy and whatever. But yeah. Have fun with that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 